Okay, this is a quick lesson on how to display your readability statistics in Microsoft Word 2007, and I'll fill in with words for 2003. And what this, these readability statistics are, which are also called Flesh Reading Ease Tests and Flesh Kincaid Grade Level Tests, is they are designed to show how easy or difficult a certain passage is to comprehend. So let's go. You can go to this window icon and click Options. 2003 users are going to want to go to Tools, uh, uh, tab up here somewhere, and then click on Tools, and then Options. Okay, so we click on that, and we go to Proofing. 2003 will want to click on a tab that's called Spelling and Grammar. And together, we make sure that Check, check Grammar with Spelling is clicked. So here we go. So make sure that's clicked, and then Show Readability Statistics, and make sure that's clicked. And OK. And you're done. And now to use it, you want to go to this Review tab. Usually it's at home. So we go to the Review tab, and here it is, Spelling and Grammar. You want to click on this. 2003 users should actually have a similar icon like this already on their home toolbar. So we go to Review, click Spelling and Grammar, and yes, I want to see it. And here we go. So we have the word count, characters, all these things we're probably familiar with. And then down here, we have the Reading E score of 77.3 and a Flesh Kincaid grade level score of 3.9. And what this basically means is that fourth graders can easily understand this passage we have right here. And, and the score of 77.3, which means that um, it's simple enough for both of these grade levels to be able to understand it, which is 11-year-olds and 13- and 15-year-olds. OK, so now let's go ahead and test it out to show you how you can just look at small passages as well, not the entire document. So here we go, simple sentence. I do not like them, Sam I am. I do not like green eggs and ham. Now to do this, you want to go to the spelling grammar tab again. This time you actually click no because you don't want it to do the entire passage, just the selection you made. So click no and it tells you right here. So we have it right here. Uh, so point fifth graders, so five, I guess, kindergartners, they can comprehend green eggs and ham sufficiently well. Okay, now let's go to a slightly more advanced writer to show you how things change. We'll go to Robert Louis Stevenson, author of Treasure Island, and his passage right here, which is, don't write merely to be understood, write so that you cannot possibly mis be misunderstood. Okay, we'll click on spelling and grammar. Once again, we only want the selection. And here we go. What we see is any students from sixth to fifth grade can comprehend this passage relatively well. And please remember that um, it said that the national average is actually eighth grade reading level. So shoot for that when you write your passages. Thank you. Bye.